I, I think tonight, uh, important statements, basketball took the right steps and getting better. Um, you know, it wasn't the result anyone ever dreams of coming in the facility. I know I've been in here three times as a player and I never walked out the victor, but uh, as the head coach of ESU men's basketball, after our game against Tulsa and today, I think we're in the right direction. I'm very appreciative to Coach Self and the staff for this opportunity. Uh, very good young players from, you know, Jamari Trailer to Ben McLemore to <coughs> Elijah Johnson to Withy to Relifer. Very good team. I think they're going in the right direction with the young talent they got. Uh, the, the way they share the ball, the way they move the ball, when the game down and reached, their ball pressure took us out of our, our flow and our rhythm. And on offense, the ball really never touched the ground too often. They got side to side to side. They got open shots. I think they went on a stretch where they banged three threes in a row. Nadir banged two of them. Uh, Travis uh, uh, banged one. So, I mean, at the end of the day, uh, I, I've been to the practices, like four or five practices last year, and I had a chance to see Jamari Trailer. Uh, bang heads with T-Rob, and he was one guy that never backed down. He came at him. Now, is he skilled as T-Rob? No, but he still is a redshirt freshman. Uh, I think I think their size, their length, can cause a lot of people a lot of trouble. Uh, when, when you sit back and look at the way they're just so unselfish with the ball, it, it's not about the me, it's about the we with the Jayhawks. And, and, and I think, you know, they're very dangerous and very deserving of their ranking. Uh, to get better, to get better. I mean, I thought in the second half we got better. We, we only committed seven turnovers. Uh, we, we got pounded on the boards. That's something that uh, after Saturday's game, we won the battle on the boards. We, we, we came up short on this one. And uh, we didn't knock down open shots. I thought I thought our motion offense, our pass game offense, uh, we, we screened, we cut, we set up cuts, we came off the screens tight, we got open looks, we didn't bang shots, and, and a lot of it was credit to their defense, had us sped up, had us out of rhythm, had us out of the flow. So at the end of the day, if we just take care of the ball, uh, limit teams to one shot, and, and really start focusing on just getting the ball from side to side to side, I, I think I think it'll be a good season. I mean, I, I told my guys, I said, yeah, you know, in, in an ideal world, you'd love to come in here and win the game, but if you win this, win this game and lose 20 in a row, no one's not going to remember this game. So it is what it is. Uh, just basically, uh, we didn't give up. Um, like you said, they, they came out down. They went on a run where they hit like at the time I like, was up, and then we, next thing I know, we were down 31 to 15. So we just kept battling. You know, we got a lot of young guys. They got a lot of young guys too. So just that we kept fighting and playing as a team. Nobody lost their head and just kept, kept together as a team. So.